they're normally quiet in the stand. This morning we have uh, three cows in heat and uh, artificial insemination is uh, here. That's the guy that um, artificially inseminates the cows to get them pregnant. He's here and we're going to show you that operation in a minute. So there's three of them here and uh, we will take it from there. Now we'll just put the two of them, uh, the cows, into the brush. Owen is their artificial inseminator and Kenneth is there as well. Now these are beef cow two beef cows. As you see he wears a sleeve and we'll show you the full details. Now he has the straw in the, he inserts that in as far as into the uterus. sure that it's right. He's actually one of our, our better, uh, a very good uh, artificial inseminator with a very good conception rate. So that one is done. So he's going to put her back now. I need to both be doing a bit of work but I'd rather put her back here. Kenneth is here as well. Now she's gone back and hopefully in calf to a nangus. Now the next one is a nangus as well. One used in new sleeve again and he uses gel to make it uh, lubricated so it is easy on the cow going to insert the cow. He does about probably how many cows a day do you do on Depends on the time of the year. Well, this time of year. Hey, Jeffrey. Hey. You're pushing over 50 or 60, aren't you? 50 or 60. You can imagine his arm being tired that night. Now he's very careful to make sure that he gets it in the right place. There's no point in just sticking it in and pushing the. You'd have to remember KYA, would you, Owen? Yeah. Yeah, sure you did. yeah them two are two KYAs. Yeah. Yeah. Kenneth and Owen is talking about the uh, bulls, the cows I've read by. Just show us the, the straw on the own there before you. Yeah. Listen there, and if you see that little green one there on top uh, we'll look at, yeah that green on top there that is the actual semen okay and they are extracted from the bulls and this is a dairy one she's a cow heifer that's oldish and she's getting very hard to go in calf so hopefully I'd say this is the last time she'll be AI'd if she's not a success this time we'll, she'll be beefed up and sent to um, into a beef farmer to uh, so she'd end up being slaughtered and when they're uh, in in heat they're normally quiet in the stand well they're quiet when they're in the crush but when they're in the field they're very excited but when they're in the crush they're inside the stand because they were waiting for the bull yeah thanks on for that thank you Pardon? Ah, yeah, for last year or so, yeah. Uh, and along with that is just to maybe explain the cow cycles every between about 19 and 23 or 4 days. Normally, 21 days is probably the best, is the most uh, fertile time when they do that cycle. But some of them will cycle from about 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23 days. And um, yeah, so they're probably different than humans. Humans cycle, I think. Uh, I'm not big into women's uh, fertility, but I believe it's 28 days. So a cow is uh, there is 21 days again, 
and um, yeah, we'll know in 21 days if that animal held or not.